have you been looking for a tool that will make your PowerPoint presentations more engaging and alive? Good thing you clicked this video. I know for many, many years, educators like me and other professionals have been searching for that tool that can allow us to run multiple choice questions, short answer activities, maybe a quick survey, or probably a word cloud activity without having to switch from many different apps and sites. Because you know, sometimes that could be too much of a hassle. And I'm here to tell you today that the search is over. Because all those things that I mentioned earlier can be done using this software. And what's better is you can do it inside your PowerPoint presentation file itself. By the way, I am Teacher Jolly. Ang inyo, Teacher LM. And this teacher can't wait any longer, so let's get into it. This software is called ClassPoint. ClassPoint is the very first PowerPoint add-in software that I have seen that can turn a normal slide into an instant activity. Let me show you how. There are various question types that ClassPoint supports. You can create multiple toys, word cloud, short answer, slide drawing, and even image upload activities. Say we want to turn this slide into a multiple choice question activity. Which of the following is an example of an amphibian? A bat, B crab, C fish, or D frog? Of course, the answer is letter D. Now, how can we add a multiple choice question button? the upper part of your file, you will see an additional tab for Ink No Class Point. So, click natin yung tab na yan, and now you'll see more options. Right in the middle are the buttons for question types. Click multiple choice, and instantly a multiple choice button will appear on your slide. Pag pinindut natin ito, you will see some settings on the side. Bar. Now I'm just gonna set the right answer, set the time. Now you're good to go. So Miss Jelly, paano po makakasagot yung mga bata or yung mga participant? Students or participants simply have to enter the code posted on the upper right corner of your slideshow. So ganito ang kanilang makikita kapag ikaw ay nasa slideshow mode. From your participants or students' devices, pwede na silang sumugod sa multiple choice activity mo real time. And right away, you can see the results at pwede mo pa itong insert sa yung presentation. Just like this. As easy as that. Feel free to explore the other quiz tools like Word Cloud, which goes like this. Post a prompt might be a question or an imperative and let your students respond anonymously. You can also try short answer question if you'd like to pose a divergent question to know your students What's unique about the short answer quiz tool is that you get to react or like your student submissions. Also, you can download it one by one. And once again, you can insert results as your slides. Slide drawing naman to allow students to directly write or draw on your slide. Using the slide drawing tool, Students can individually write or draw on a specific slide. Teachers can also review all the slides submitted by the students. You can also give immediate feedback about their work. Sounds great, right? Or you can also use image upload like this. Now this one's really cool too. Students get to upload and submit a photo related to the prompt that you have given. So, kayo pong pahalang maglagay ng prompt sa inyong slide. It's very fun to do because students have the option to 
search on Google, search on the internet, make their own doodles or probably drawings, or they can even take their own photos and upload it to submit it to you. Now, after clicking insert results as slide, it's gonna leave you with a gallery of photos. Have fun with it! Dahil online na ating presentations, hindi na usong index cards. That's why, ClassPoint included a name picker which works like this. Pag ang mga student or participant ay nakapasok na gamit ang code, all of their names will be included here. Kapag hinlik natin ang mga colored bars na ito, i-reveal niya ang pangalan ng participant or student. This special feature makes it easier for us to choose people for recitation or even for groupings or diet activities. And if you want to spice it up a little bit, pwede kayo maganda ng live quiz competition. As you can see here, I have prepared three sample slides. This is very easy to do. We just have to click the multiple choice button and then on the sidebar, check competition mode for all three slides. Once na maselect natin yung competition mode, makikita natin yung magkakaroon ng trophy icon doon sa ating multiple choice button. Very easy to do. Okay, now let's try it out. Let's have the first question. Click natin ito to see the live status. And once done, you just have to check or click the leaderboard. Tingnan natin kung sino yung nangunguna. The ranking of our leaderboard is based on how fast the student answered and how accurate is the answer. So, gano'ng kabilis at kung tama yung kanyang sinagot. For our first question, first round, si Beck ang nangunguna. Siyempre, may chance pa rin magbago yung ranking ng ating leaderboard based on the student's performance sa mga susunod pang questions. On the second round, we have Berto with the highest rank and score sa ating leaderboard. And finally, makikita natin na si Beck ang nanalo para sa live quiz competition na ito. Now, aside from the leaderboard, we can also click this show table wherein, this is where it gets very interesting, wherein recorded lahat ng sinagot ng mga bata per question. See? We have there the names and the letters of their answer. So, makikita mo saan sila nagkamali. This software is such a game changer. And if you are wondering, Ah, libre ba yan? Yes, you can register for free and you are allowed to create 5 questions per PowerPoint file. And a maximum of 25 students to participate free of what? I know you're all excited and you have no reason not to try it. Register now by clicking the registration link in my description. I also encourage you, by the way, to join the Facebook group, the Facebook community, which link is also in my description box. Let me know how do you feel about this great news. And if you have some questions or clarification, feel free to comment it below. And I'll be glad to respond to you as much as I can. Go, go, guys! Mag-register kayo, download it, explore it, use it. I mean, I'm not, I'm not forcing you to download it, but seriously, download it. I'll see you again, champre. Bye, bye.